In this tutorial I will demonstrate how to use a clone object in Cinema 4D to distribute a piece of geometry on an intricate curved surface. As a base for the tutorial we will use the curved looped shape shown, which is named curved shape. The middle edge loop of the curved shape will be used as a guide to distribute the cloned geometry of our choice. In the object manager select the curved shape geometry. Be sure you are in edge selection mode and use the loop selection tool to select the middle spline. Right mouse click and choose the edge to spline function. Rename the resulting spline to middle spline. Add a clone object to the scene. Place a cylinder object inside and adjust its parameters to your taste. Set the clone object's mode to object. Drag and drop the middle spline into the object field and increase the count to 100. Switch to the Transform tab and set the B rotation until the cylinder is parallel to the curved shape surface. In this example it is set to 170 degrees. As you can see, the cylinders are spread out along the middle spline, but some cylinders are positioned slightly off the surface. We can resolve this. Copy the curved shape and rename it to Curved Shape 2. Then solo it by clicking the Solo button. Switch to Polygon Selection mode and use the Loop Selection and Extrude tools to slightly extrude the middle selected surface as shown. Switch to the Edge Selection mode and using the Loop Selection tool select the middle edge and transform it into a spline by right mouse click and choosing the Edge to Spline function. Rename the newly created spline to Rail. Remove the curved shape to Geometry because we don't need it anymore. Click the solo button once again to make everything visible. Drag and drop the rail spline into the rail field of the clone object. In the Transform tab, change the B rotation field to 90 degrees. As you may have noticed, now all cloned cylinders are perfectly aligned with the surface of our intricate curved shape geometry. It is a very flexible solution where an additional parallel spline is used as a guide for the precise placement of cloned objects along the geometric surface. Moreover, you didn't lose the ability to control the number of cloned cylinders you would like to use.